Well, I know it's difficult to understand. I'll explain it to you one more time and hopefully this time you'll get it. Okay. Uh, okay, but it's making no sense so far. It just seems so complicated. Um, I suppose so. Anyway, you need to get part X of the documentation signed and attach it to the end of part Y. I'm confused already. I can't even find part Y. Well, moving on, you'll see Annex B also needs to be attached and then sign all five at the bottom and send off to the address at the top. Oh, I'm sorry, dear, but I really am quite confused. Can you start again? OK, I'm going to stop it right there. This is an example of how just being polite and trying to be helpful isn't enough. This customer is getting more and more and more confused. So how would you improve it? I was trying to help her. Yes, I know, but you are moving ahead. You can only go at the customer's pace. And I was already nervous doing the procedure. So, the first part of customer service is for Lydia to convince the customer that she can do this and she will help her through the process. So, using phrases like, when you're ready, we can start, or we're going to work together on this, can help the customer. We don't want this customer becoming any more nervous because that's not going to help anyone. OK, so I say all that, and then what? When you were talking, you looked irritated. No, I didn't. I know, it's a telephone conversation. What does it matter what I look like? Well, actually, it does. Even though it's on the other end of a telephone, you can tell whether the other person is smiling or frowning. He is right, you know. I knew that you were getting irritated with me, and it just made me even more confused. Well, you could have used some phrases like, we're going to do this together, or I'm here to help you get through this, or we have plenty of time. Yes, that might have helped. OK, so even with all of that, what if she still doesn't get it? Offer to break it down into smaller bits and then take it one step at a time. Then you could email the steps. That would suit some customers. OK. Well, thanks for that. I'll give it a go.